Last time on Fire Emblem Three Houses, I spent multiple hours grinding only to lose literally one turn away from victory because I made a minor miscalculation in how fast I could get to the end of the map. This caused me to get very not filled with inner peace and stop playing angrily as I lost several hours of progress. But I'm back, and this time I did not make that mistake. So I now have a rather overpowered group of healers who will completely disregard the sanctity of human life in order to benefit themselves. Wait a minute, that's just the American healthcare system. After slaughtering at least 50 generic units, the group arrives at Remire Village, where they witness the horrific atrocities that take place on the fabled website known as Twitter.com. It turns out that Solon had impersonated several villagers from Remire and insulted Dream Minecraft, the My Hero Academia fandom, Genshin Impact, and Danganronpa, no idea if I pronounce that, and frankly I don't care, in a series of tweets that led rabid members of these fandom to do what any Twitter user does when they see an opinion violence and attempted murder. Dimitri and Byleth, upon seeing the atrocities, understand the only cure for such malignant and insidious disorders as Twitter is violence. Indiscriminate violence. Unfortunately, Solon gets away before we can turn his spine into spaghetti as punishment for him creating Twitter.com. As Byleth and Geralt leave the battle, they are presented with the illusion of choice, a classic in video games and something that I definitely don't despise with a passion that burns as hot as the sun, because it is entertaining to watch the choice that I make in a dialogue prompt be completely disregarded. Once the Blue Lions return to the monastery, Dimitri and Byleth discuss their mutual hatred for Twitter, which somehow spirals into Dimitri explaining all of his childhood trauma to Byleth and they find a new kinship in their mutual desire to purge the world of toxicity through extreme, senseless violence. 